you started? Um, I mean, he uh, the the all I figured out about him was through my agent and then through family because he started with the Wasserman, uh, the right. development, uh, the, the players over the over the summer. Um, so just kind of like that, uh, asking about him and everything. And then when I met him, everything was the truth. So. Yeah. You chose number 44. Was yeah. That yeah. Because it draws him. Yeah. Long story. Um, I even ask everybody in Croatia, you know, if they have any advice for it. Um, since I started uh, all these comparisons uh, with him, uh, obviously one of the, if not the greatest European player of all time, um, and just in respect for for him, uh, the journey continues. You know, in, in, in his name right now, and I'm glad that uh, I am the uh, the leader of of that journey right now, and just um, I would say just carrying my entire country. Uh, with us, so. So growing up and playing uh, back there, did you kind of emulate him, or what, what is he like? I mean, I just, you know, even when I met, uh, his brother was my coach, uh, wow. thankfully, national team, so I was on him every day, hey, what he does here, how was he there, how was he off the court, and so I was um, asking everybody um, the questions about him. I still have to meet the, his agent uh, at the time. I, I was asking my agent who was he, so I just figured that out yesterday. So I want to meet with him in Los Angeles, ask more questions about it. But just asking everybody, you know, um, as much as information as, as I can get because, you know, I, this is very special for me. You know, I'm, and it gets to my number eight with four and four. So uh, yeah. I'm very, very um, uh, glad that I can continue this for him in his name. How, how would you describe your career so far? Um, well, <laughs> uh, two rough st stations uh, in NBA, uh, unfortunate situations. Um, uh, we had a developing young team. Uh, we're not really in a, in a, in a, in a place to win. Uh, but I, I think uh, after every year, uh, I got better just because of my dedication. And uh, my hard work and my um, approach to, to basketball, it, it didn't matter to me what was the situation. I, just, I was just concentrated on, uh, on, my, on myself and on, on the team and how much I can help and how much <coughs> I can get better. So I think even through, um, it tells a lot about my character, even through a lot of bad situations and about, uh, in, in a bad um, uh, examples the, the, that I had, I, I just came out a, a, as a better person and a better player. Uh, and it showed on the court, you know, I, I was in a situation where I had to play the four. I was, I was asking Frank Vogel at the time, well, what is this coach? I, I never played this, you know. So uh, it, it just, you know, showed a lot. They, they actually test me a lot, uh, in, in, especially in Orlando and in, uh, in New York. So I'm, I'm thankful for that as well. It's funny because you're kind of listed as a forward. I just looked at a bunch of your highlights and you look like more like a point guard. Yeah, I mean, it, it's it's weird even for me. I was drafted at what was it, six six, one ninety five. Now I'm six nine, two forty. You know, so it's it's just it, it's weird. And then at the end of the last year, uh, Coach Fisdale, which I'm very uh, thankful to work uh, with him. Uh, last year he just said that he would be my point guard right now. It, it was towards the end of the season, but still he gave me the opportunity that I can now cover for. Uh, position which is going to definitely help us here right now. But you grew up playing point guard. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And so do you like it? Absolutely. Yeah. I'll okay. talk to Damien about that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel like you might fit in with the team in, in terms of skill set and position weight? Um, well, definitely with the, that um, after Damien, after CJ, that uh, kind of ET role that he had uh, the second ball handling guy. Uh, and obviously I will be playing the three and four uh, a lot. So definitely, you know, we have a Potentially, like a amazing uh, small ball unit, you know, uh, stretch the floor, shoot. So we'll see. It's hard to speak about it right now. <laughs> so why is that? Just because you're not sure, or you no, no, I'm absolutely sure. But you, you just gotta fit in, you yeah, know. Yeah. Uh, this team was in Western Conference Finals last year, you know. So I'm here to help, and uh, my individual goal for myself this year is to push them um, even further. Uh, this. Uh, coming year so what does it mean to you to be a part of a, a team that ha is successful right now that is coming off of a conference final it's my first time experiencing so uh, <laughs> yeah. um, I'm definitely all about that right now um, 
I wanted to be on a successful team, uh, surround myself with the better players than myself, and um, the, because they will help me, you know, they, they will help me be uh, even better and become uh, that top tier player uh, one, uh, eventually. So um, I'm really looking forward to it. And when you saw Portland's name pop up as an option, that had to excite you then? It excited me even last year. But I had to explain this in New York. So. <laughs> I mean, I'm just meeting everybody in, uh, today, and I'm just saying I'm, I'm sorry for last year. You know? So yeah, yeah. So uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm really really happy to be a part of this. Um, I heard a lot of things, a lot of positive things, but now that I'm, it's my only first day. So um, so far so good, and I'm really thankful to to be here. Can you describe like what those emotions must be like? To obviously you're very talented. You know, Neil's gushed about you. But you haven't yet put up, kind of. I haven't put up anything yet. Yeah. So what? What is that like? Knowing that you have. It's fine because I will. Yeah. Um, it, it's kind of sad if I can say that I couldn't do what I do um, in in Orlando, in New York. In New York, I understand it's. It was really like a family situation. Everybody was, you know, I was really trying to help everybody around because uh, we had a lot of guys. Uh, still develop me, developing, we drafted a lot of rookies and all this stuff. Uh, but it kind of, I can't say really sad, but l let's just use it. For, for Orlando, that I couldn't, I really couldn't be myself because it was one, one, one season this, the other season that. It was kind of like, yeah, I mean, to be, yeah, even that uh, affected us a, a little bit. But it was just, you know, we were a young group, not ready to win yet, but then we had a lot of veterans at, at one point, so it was, it was just, Messy a little bit, so I mean, it is what it is. It's NBA, so it happens. So does that make Come you like more? Then we got to wrap it up. Make you like eager to show what you have. Absolutely, that's why I'm here. Yeah. I've seen so much the, about the way you play on the on the court because I, I think people see some of your highlights and they see some of the blocks and the dunks. Mm -hmm. and it seems like you you've got a lot of confidence out there in yourself. And, mm -hmm. and uh, how would you describe kind of your your demeanor on the court in that respect? I mean, I just go out there to kill. Yeah, it's it's, it's pretty it's pretty pretty simple and. Um, in these situations, it'll be manifested even more because this is a winning organization. It's, I mean, as I told you, this is a Western Conference Finals team. So it just, it's, it has to be that mentality every day, every game. You what know. Is, what is your relationship with Yusuf like? Well, we live um, door to door back home. Uh, we used to uh, before I before I left to Barcelona and uh, and, and Orlando. Uh, obviously, he's uh, probably closer to my father than I am. Uh, yeah, because when uh, when I left, he was still uh, he still played in uh, Sevita Zagreb. So my my brother. That's <laughs> there's nothing more to say. He's just super super close to me. He always told me great things about about the city, about this team, and uh, we we we're, we're super close. When you say door to door, what do you mean? Like literally, literally door to door like my building is right next to his building i can wow. yell at him every day <laughs> so yeah wow. yeah going back to drazen when he came here i mean there were books written in, in croatia about people feeling he didn't get a chance here that he never got the opportunity to show what he could do here did, did you ever hear anything about that about discontent with portland and the way yeah that's used? the story back back home yeah. and that's why i chose his number so i can success in his Change name that. yeah